So you need to record something on your computer's screen. The good news is you probably already have the software to do this on your computer. Here are ways to record your screen on both a Windows PC and Mac OS. First, we'll start with Windows users. If you're a Mac user, feel free to skip ahead. For Windows, if you'd rather not download any additional software, you'll want to use a built-in tool for gamers called GameBar. Most PCs have the ability to use this, but just so you know, these are the encoder requirements for the GameBar recorder to work. Okay, here we go. Step one, click the Start button followed by the gear icon located on the Start menu. This opens the Settings app. Step two, select Gaming. Step three, under Game Bar, be sure the Record Game Clips screenshots and Broadcast Using Game Bar option is toggled on. Step 4. Type the default keyboard shortcut to open the Game Bar, Win plus G. You may or may not see a prompt asking if the highlighted application on your screen is a game. If you do, lie and select Yes. Step 5. The Game Bar appears near your screen's top center edge. It provides buttons to access multiple overlays, including sound, performance, and capture. The Game Bar's capture overlay should appear by default. If not, click the webcam icon on the Game Bar. After that, click the round Start Recording button on the capture overlay. Click it again to stop. Alternatively, you can type the Win plus Alt plus R key combination to start and stop recording with Game Bar enabled. All video captures save to the videos slash captures folder as an MP4 file. All right, now for the Mac users. Included with the Mac OS Mojave is a native feature that allows you to record your screen and take screenshots. Here's how. Step one, press Command plus Shift plus five to bring up the screenshot toolbar. Step two, the toolbar appears on your screen. You'll see two sets of buttons, three on the left to capture a screenshot and two in the middle for recording the screen. You'll also see Option and Capture or Record buttons. Click the Record Entire Screen or Record Selected Portion button followed by the Record button. It replaces Capture if the tool was originally in screenshot mode, located on the right. Step three, when you're done, click the Stop Screen Recording button or the little Record button located on the menu bar. Your video saves to the desktop by default. There are several other options to record your screen, as well as third-party software you can download. If you'd like to learn more, head on over to digitaltrends.com, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel.